Jordan Oliver, the senior junior from Easton out of District 11, 44 and 1, 134 and 5 career record, taking on Indian Valley senior Nick Bedleon from District 6, 41 and 2, 123 and 13 career record. He is coached by Joe Dauber. And Oliver, so quick off the opening whistle, the returning state champ from Easton last season. One green, you're Two to neutral. one, Bedleon on the escape. Now Oliver has been that wrestler all season long that people have looked to come back and repeat after winning a state championship last year at 103. He was a state runner up his freshman season, which is the highest finish for a freshman in Easton wrestling history. Well, Doug, last year was just a fabulous year. He finished the season 48 and 0. He was ranked number one in the country by Amateur Wrestling News at 103. And he won the finals in last year's PIAA championships over Nico Cortez from Greensburg Central Catholic 6 to 2. And really didn't have a tough match at all in the tournament and won the Outstanding Wrestler yeah, Award. Work through the middle. Oliver's credentials, a three-time Northeast Regional Champ, a three-time District 11 Champ. He's won the Mannheim Tournament three times. His only loss this season was in the Reno Tournament of Champions final. He lost to Nico Trigas of Camp Blandona, California, 7-4. to four. I mentioned during the Kegan Handlevik match at 112, the last time that Easton had back-to-back -back champs and back-to-back -back weight classes was 1997. And what's interesting about that is there's connections on the Easton bench to both of those. We just saw Jamar Billman. He was one of those reasons. Brian Snyder was the other. His dad, Barry Snyder, is to Steve Powell's left now on the Easton, or in the Easton corner. Looking for the Rovers' second state champ here tonight. There is Barry Snyder on the right, Steve Powell on the left. And this weight class, 119, with well, the anticipation in the beginning of the season of the matchups, Red, the possible matchup, Red, Joe Daubert, talk the head coach at Green. Indian Valley out of District 6. But this Ready was a deep first. weight class, so deep Green that there's some quality down. wrestlers that left here without Six, medals. Stay there, top. And Bedleon, while it's a reward to get to the final and you hit Jordan Oliver, what a battle he has had to make it this far into the finals at 119. Oh, yeah. He, he went into overtime in his semifinal match against Chris Kuczynski from Middletown, winning that match 4-2 to two in the overtime tiebreaker. Watch that arm. Watch that arm. Won his Get it down. Get it down. Quarterfinal match against Nico Cortez from Hempfield, 2-1. to One. one two. Holding two. Holding two. Holding two. Oliver has two back points being held. Holding My two. referee, Holding two. friend Michael. Bedleon is a two-time state Holding medalist two. out of Indian Valley, fifth Holding and fourth two. in 06 and 05. He's won the Northwest Regional Championships twice in 06 and 07, a two-time District 6 champ. Holding two. His only two losses this season, he lost in the King of the Mountain semifinals to Derek now. Reber of Lewisburg, and he lost in the Powerade Tournament to Nico Cortez, 4-2 in the semifinals. And now Oliver takes a 4-1 lead. Well, Oliver from the top position, he's got a near cradle locked up. And you can see Bedley and heading for the out of bounds line. And one of the question marks with Jordan Oliver this year across the state was, could he move up two weight classes and could he continue to dominate and he has proven throughout the season with wins over Chris Sheets twice including earlier today and his performance in the postseason that he is big enough and strong enough and can go upper body with the full 119 pound okay. like we're seeing here and, and Chris Sheets from Upper Perkiomen out of District 1 a former state champion in his own right a couple of years ago is a fabulous wrestler and Oliver beat him five to three in his semifinal match this morning at 8 a.m. A lot of discussion during last weekend's Northeast Regionals whether or not the PIAA would re-bracket Sheets and Oliver 
but because he was not a state champ from last year, they met in the semifinals. They met in the state dual meet semis as well, going to the ultimate tiebreaker. Oliver, a little bit different approach, just like we saw here tonight. A quick offensive attack to get that lead and then just be able to ride and Rams ride and ride. Yeah, he, in fact, he got called for stalling Rams twice in his semifinal match against right Sheets. The last time Jordan Oliver has lost to an opponent in Pennsylvania was two years ago when he lost to Matt Kyler of Clearfield in the 103 pound final. Perfect last year at 48 no. His only loss this year was at Reno to Trigas from California. One thing to mention about Trigas from California, California state champion, the state of California is not divided into two different classes like Pennsylvania's AA and AAA, the largest populous, most populous state in the country is just one class of high school wrestling. So to be a California state champion is a grueling affair. Take it back in the middle. With the 112 pound medal winners, please make your way to the awards area, please. We reach the one minute mark of the third period. And Oliver on the strength of the takedown to start the bout, and the two back points in the second. It's kind of settled into cruise control here in the third. Very difficult to score on. Bedley on, close. You're He's got 35 seconds to work with here. You're neutral, you're neutral, you're neutral. There's no control. You're neutral. Watch that knee. Potentially dangerous is called by Fran Michael, our referee out of District 2, 37 years as an official. A restart with a 10 seconds to go. Another inside leg trip. And give Bedley some F A for effort for trying to score some points late in the third period. So Jordan Oliver will win it four to one, win his second state title for Easton. And for the first time since 1997, the Rovers will have back-to-back -back champs in back-to-back -back weight classes. Jordan Oliver, your 2007 champ at 119. Four to one over Nick Bedleon of Indian Valley. We'll go to the medals at 112. <laughs> 